Welcome to the Medallion Minute. We're back here at the beautiful practice center here at the Medallion Club. And today I'm going to talk to you about uh, setting up in your posture. And then Jonathan Christofferson is going to continue his short game series today. And he's going to talk about hitting the bunker shot. We want to talk about posture because a lot of people get in bad postures when they're hitting the golf shot. We either see standing straight up, trying to hit a, po a shot, and they get way too close to it. We see a lot of knee bend, and they're almost sitting down to hit the shot. Um, in both of those instances, you'll see when you have too much knee bend, it gives play in the knees. So we end up standing up or sitting down while we're swinging the shot. The key to the posture is that we want the knees stable and we want our spine angle stable. You know, as we set up to hit this shot, if our spine is stable through the swing, this club has to basically come right back down to the ball. When we see people topping or hitting fat shots, we've either noticed their knees have gone or their spine has changed angles, which makes you either dip down for it, or a lot of times we see on your backswing, you stand up in your spine, which leaves you above the ball, which you can lead to topping it. There's a couple good ways that you can get into your posture. So there's two different options, whichever one feels comfortable for you. The first one would be to set up to the ball with your arms hanging straight down. You're going to lock your knees, push your backside out, which gives you that spine angle, and then just release the lock in your knees just a little bit. You notice I'm not sitting down. I've got bent knees, athletic position. The other way would be is to stand with your arms out in front of you. You're going to, oh, your arms are going to be a little bit higher than, than level with your body. You're going to lower your arms till your bicep hits your chest. You're going to lower the club with your spine until it's about two inches off the ground and the rest of the way you're going to use your knee bend to get it down. So when I set up to it, I got a bunch of checkpoints here. So I know I got to move closer. Club's elevated. I bend my knees to get down and I'm in a good posture. The key is to keep your knees and your spine the same through the swing. So we're set up. We're in a good posture. We can hit a good shot that way. Now we're going to go over to Jonathan in the bunker, who's going to talk about the bunker shot. Thanks, Michael. We're out here on the back of the driving range in one of our practice bunkers, and we're going to show you how to get out of the sand today. Now today we're going to use the technology built into our sand wedges to help us get out of the bunker onto the green. You'll notice that the bottom of your sand wedge has probably got a little bit more of a rounded edge, and that gets that leading edge of the club up off the ground, or in this case, the bunker. That's called bounce. And what that does, that prevents the club from digging into the ground and helps us cut through the sand. So we're gonna utilize this by opening the club face at a dress and really helping us get through it and not dig into the sand. So like I said, we're gonna open the club face at a dress. When you set up to it, you do want the club face pointed directly at your target, at the pin. And to compensate for that, I'm gonna have to hit this with an open stance. So my feet are actually left of the target since I'm right-handed. Now, the swing itself is a lot more vertical than a pitch shot, so we want to envision our shot being like a V. Very steep coming up, down to the ball, and back up again. We're going to have a very quiet body going back, not much rotation at all, and then a big turn coming through, making sure we accelerate. Now, the biggest problem that we see with this shot is someone that just digs the club into the sand and doesn't get through the golf ball. Okay, one drill that you can do to do this is without a golf ball, I set up to it, and I want to try to throw the sand out of the bunker and onto the green. And if I do that, if I'm accelerating all the way through it, that sand will get out onto the, onto the green. If I don't, it doesn't go as far, okay? So we'll set up to this shot. Like I said, open club face. My club face is pointed right at the flag. My feet are left of the target. I want to make sure I dig myself in. Get a nice solid stance, and I'm gonna swing like a V. Upright, quiet body going back, down at the ball, up right through, making sure I get a big turn, and I'm gonna throw that sand onto the green just like the drill. That'll get you out of the bunker every single time. Thanks for watching.